Hey guys, we have the JBL Flip 6 Bluetooth speaker and in this video we want to explain to you how to remove the USB-C charging port of the speaker. So we start out by using a simple flat blade screwdriver which we are going to wedge right at this position here uh, where you have this little gap on the grill. And now we can start to pry off the grill at this one point here and then we're going to repeat the same step on the opposite side here. We loosen this on this end too and then right in the middle this is where we have to do it the third time. So now we have already the one side loose and then we, we can uh, repeat this one more time here on the opposite side also right in the center and now the grill is completely loose and we can remove it and slide it off to the side. Then next we're going to remove the plastic cover that's by the power button and the charging port you can see there's a couple of tabs that hold that in place. You can see two here around the center and all we have to do is just use a little prying tool and just pop them off. There are also additional tabs on the ends of this plastic piece on the far left and on the far right. But I'm going to just start here in the center and eventually we will be able to take off this entire plastic piece. Then right next to the charging port we find two small Phillips screws. So let us take those out. Now the remaining clear plastic cover is still glued in position so we have to use a prying tool again to get this one out. So at this point we have almost taken out the small board with the USB port. Now it is just still connected with the harness to the uh, main board. So we still have to get to that harness and detach it. And in order to get there I first remove here the passive radiator, this little end cap. And I'm just using again my prying tool by going into these little grooves here, you see these? And then it is relatively easy to pop this piece off. Now we can see the small board in here with the uh, with a big uh, white connector attached to it, but we can't really access it yet because of those wires that go to the driver. Uh, so I'm just also going to remove the driver at this point just to get there a little bit easier. Okay, so now it is time to uh, detach the harness here so there's a simple connector that we have to pull off and then we can already uh, get the whole board out that has the uh, USB-C port attached to it. So now let me give you a little bit close-up of the board. You can see here this is specific to the Flip 6 so finding a replacement may be really tricky but probably over time there will be several broken Flip 6 available where you can take out this board and then Put it right back into your own speaker yeah okay so this was already it for this video i hope you found it helpful and if you have any more questions or comments then leave a message below